Hello everybody, this is Detecting Daddy from Boston, Massachusetts, and what you were looking at is a bottle of Date Restore, or rather known as Negadate, and some Q-tips. Why? Good question. Right here you are looking at eight more Buffalo Nickels that look like they don't have a date. Or do they? Well, this one here looks like something's been done to it. Why? Because I already did that one earlier. That is in 1920 Philadelphia. The rest of these, not so sure. However, why would I have a video about eight more Buffalo Nickels when I just did eight? I haven't done any more box of nickels, so where did they come from? Good question. Well, I recently purchased a few Buffalo Nickels, all undated. Kind of in a bulk lot, you could say. And, uh, well, I'll show them to you now. A couple there, and a couple more, and a couple more, and a couple more, and there you go. Over 350 undated or partial dated Buffalo Nickels. Well, I'm going to start a series unveiling the Buffalo Nickel coming up soon. I don't know how many I'll do in each video, 20, 25, maybe only 10 or 15, who knows? We'll have to see. But I had a lot of fun doing those eight nickels that I did just a few days ago that I thought this would be a lot of fun as well. Now some of these, like I said, have partial dates. Some of them I looked at, I can actually read the date. And some are just so corroded and nasty that I probably won't do anything with at all. Or maybe I will in like the last video. But I am really looking forward to this. Uh, and this was a very small investment and could possibly have a very large return, believe it or not. At least I think so anyway. I know that once you nick a data coin, it is definitely considered altered and slashes the price of that coin in half at G4 at best. Well, this is a series that's going to be coming up very soon. Uh, maybe once a week I'll be doing this. Maybe once a day, I don't know yet. I haven't planned out a, a schedule with this, but a friend of my, Seamus, um, is really excited about it and wants to stop by and say hello as well and help me with this. So I can't wait for you to meet Seamus. Great guy, really great guy. And um, this is going to be a lot of fun for me. I'm assuming at least a 10 part video series, which would be a first for me. Um, the only thing I've really done besides this is shown um, nickels and pennies, uh, one box of halves, and some metal detecting finds. So this is going to be a real adventure for me. And I hope you guys are going to enjoy this as much as I do. Please leave comments down below, share, like, subscribe, and definitely stay tuned for an exciting series coming up. Until next time, happy hunting.